How y'all doing? Run that dress B again. I was up here at where I'm working right now because I lost my job. I'm working for my uncle and I thought I'd just make a video. It's uh, like 12 o'clock at night. I was pretty bored so I decided to make a video. I haven't made one in like two or three weeks maybe, if not longer. So this is kind of like a short notice thing. I got up here this morning. I was supposed to have been up here at 10. I didn't get up here till 1. So I didn't have time to, to bring one of my mini mud jugs I got. So I'm kind of upset about that. Let's throw us a dip in. Grizzly. I want a green long cut. Keep thinking my camera's over here because it's usually over here. Whatever. I got enough for one dip left. So, uh, I decided my uncle called me and he needed my help. So I decided to come up here and help him redoing his house. Or the one he just bought. And uh I need the money, so So last Tuesday I'm pretty excited that Donald Trump won. That was a hell of an election. So uh in honor of in America so we do it so if I didn't know I moved again for like the third time since I'm making videos I think I did tell you all that in my last video so if I told you my last video, I don't remember. I think I did though. But I moved again. And uh... I would also like... I'm making this video mainly because I love Donald Trump, and I'm pretty excited that he won. They didn't announce that he won until like 2.30 in the morning. And me and my stepbrother said it's like 6 in the morning. So we were freaking excited. So happy about it. And then we went to bed at 6, woke up at 7.30, went to town and ate breakfast. We were pretty excited. I couldn't sleep. That was a glorious breakfast. I hope y'all can hear me okay. Because y'all can tell I'm in a camper. Because it's all I can live in right now. While I'm gone. And I'm, the reason I said that is because I got a freaking heater going on. Because it's like. 30 degrees outside, and I just got to my camper like five minutes ago. I, I got here, set my bag down, started making a video. So, um, the heat, it's still cold in here. I got my heater running right here. And have y'all heard about all the freaking, the freaking dumbass Hillary supporters in California? Freaking beating the shit out of that guy, stealing his fucking car. That was ignorant. I just thought I'd give y'all a quick, quick update. I was bored. 
wanted to make and edit a video. And, uh, I don't have that much to talk about other than the election right now. That and I need to find a job. I'm trying. This is my notes for when I make videos. Like when I decide I'm going to make a video one day, that morning I start, I just write a bunch of stuff that I'm going to talk about. I'm going to have a couple things written down. I don't know if it's true or not, but I heard, I doubt it's true, hope it is, that California is going to secede from the United States. Pretty happy about that, if that happens. are warm. That was sarcasm if you didn't know that. And I wanted y'all to give me some ideas on what kind of new dips do y'all want me to dip during a video. I'll tell you that if it's good or not. And after, remember I told you I was going to give the hat and the koozie away? After so many subscribers, I changed my mind. I'm going to do a full can after 500 subscribers. I'm going to do a full can. I don't like the smell of wintergreen. I don't know why I dip wintergreen because I freaking hate the smell of it. It almost makes me freaking throw up. I like the taste of it, and that's probably why I did it. I don't know. I don't like the smell of it. I can prove that to you. It's really gross. It like, gives me the chills, I don't know. Well, oh. don't like it. <laughs> And I would also like for y'all to comment what kind of new dips and what y'all what y'all dip or whoever watches this dips. Just comment below what you dip. No matter if you like me or not. Just drop a comment if you what what your favorite dip is and that you day, that you dip on a daily. If I could afford it, my daily dip would be Copenhagen Long Cut or co actually Copenhagen Snuff. I love Copenhagen Snuff. It's really good. I don't like how fine cut it is though. Fine cut. I don't like fine cut. But I do like covering it snow. As you can see, I got the new Backwoods Badass can lid. One thing that I noticed about this can lid, I don't know if you can see it or not. There it goes. You can, it's starting to crack on one edge. Two edges. You can probably you can see a little bit right there, right there. And right there. I guess that's that's where I mainly pry up on it. It's starting to crack. I don't know. I think this is the first video I made. I haven't had to stop it and edit it. I'm pretty good. phone freaking back on and what's weird about living here is I don't have any cell phone service at all none well, 
I'll show you. I wish it would focus. Well, anyway, it says no service. So it's kind of pointless on my phone here, but I have Wi Fi. The building that's right beside me that I live next to, it's got Wi Fi in it, so I got Wi Fi, so I can upload it. So this is basically the video for today. I'm not on my phone texting anybody. I don't have any service. I'm looking at my notes. I don't have that many notes. Focus. Or don't focus. Cool. That's about it. I actually have two different notes. This is the one I made for today's video. <clears throat> I wanted to mainly talk about the election, but I don't really have that much to talk about other than I'm pretty happy that Trump won. Oh, and I didn't like how before they announced Pennsylvania, but Hillary knew she was going to lose. And so she had her her freaking Podesta come out there. I'm pretty sure it's Podesta. If I'm wrong, correct me. I'm sorry. I'm pretty sure that's who it was. Told everybody to go home. And she didn't even come out and speak, give a freaking speech or nothing. Thought that was pretty shitty. So this is just a kind of a, actually it's a pretty damn long video, it's been 13, almost 13 minutes already. But future videos I'm going to, I have written down. I'm going to do, well if I get 500 subscribers I'm going to do the, the full can. I'm going to, I've seen some other dipping channels do the, the, the dip suicides. I think uh, Joe Led's Dippin' did one. Outlaw Dipper did one. I'm pretty sure Mug Mud Jug One did one. Uh, I I have to go back and look at that. Pretty sure he did. I'm not for sure though. I'm going to do. Is dipping good for you? Uh, Mud Jug One proves that it is. It's actually good for you. I wouldn't say in the sense that it's like it's healthy for you. But, um. It's not bad for you either. And this. Freaking bullshit. That's not true. can't remember the guy's name, but if you go over to Mud Jug One Channel, he did like a 30 minute inter interview with the guy that wrote a book, and he just, like an actual pro like professor, and he did this, like a, he'd been studying for, for like 20 years on tobacco, and dipping, it does not hurt you at all. So, I don't think it, it hurts you, especially after I watched this video. I didn't. I never did think it did. As long as you keep up, to, I haven't kept up with my teeth. See that? But if you keep up, if you keep up with your gums and teeth, it ain't gonna hurt you at all. So, tell me what kind of what your favorite dip is. Like this video, so I know that you like the content in the video. And, and if you don't like the content, comment 
the content that you want to see me do, and I'll do it. I'm here to make you guys happy. Not necessarily all of you happy. I still want to do what I want to do, but I want y'all to suggest things that y'all want me to do so I can pick and choose which one I want to do.